All right, guys, so I did something that I've been waiting 20 years to do, and my youngster has no idea. So I'm gonna quickly show you here before he comes out. This is what I did. So let's just stand here and film him for a second. He'll be coming out this door any second. Not sure how long it's gonna take him, but he'll be here. I'm gonna wipe this lens real quick. Here he comes, I saw the door. Happy early birthday. <laughs> you weren't expecting that, were you? <laughs> no, it wasn't. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> How sick is that? <laughs> okay, let's unstrap these bitches. Alright, so as you see in there, I ended up surprising my youngster with a dirt bike. He had no idea I was getting them. I kind of led on that I was thinking about it, but he didn't know it was actually going to happen. So, there's the bikes. The 2023 uh, 250F and the 2023 CRF 125F. So... We're just gearing up now. We are going to give these a real shakedown. We've been out on them a few times, but um, not a heck of a lot. So, so we're gonna take them out, shred a little bit, and we will be back with you to give you our impressions. So stay tuned. Family cruising day. So we got my youngster and we got my little brother Jesse out on his XR. Both of us on our CRF. So we're gonna explore, see what we can see. I gotta say, riding one-handed, not easy. We're making do. So as you see, we've been rocking the CRF F-Series bikes for a little while now, and uh, we've enjoyed them. They've been great. However, if you're thinking of getting one for your youngster and you're not sure what type of riding they want, I strongly recommend figuring that out beforehand because, well, as you can see, that's how long it lasted. Already rocking the... <laughs> Already rocking the YZ85, so let's see. All right, yeah, there's nothing wrong with the CRF 125F, but it wasn't what he wanted. He wanted something more that he can jump on and just, you know, full shred. And the YZ85 is gonna do exactly that for him. I was a little skeptical when he was, you know, telling me what he wanted to do, sell the 125 and buy this. I was like, man, why would you want to do that? But now I understand it. This little 160 pound bike has more power than my 250 CC full-size dirt bike. It's ridiculous, so lots more video to come on this. In conclusion to the last part that you've seen us film there, where my youngster sold his Honda and bought a YZ85, as you can see, things have changed a little bit since then. I've sold my CRF and bought a YZ250F. The only one left with the Honda is my brother. Yes, that's a new truck as well. So we're going to head out, do some riding, and we'll be back with you.
All right, so we got the bikes all loaded up. We dropped my little brother off at home and my youngster and I are going to head out to a motocross track a couple hundred kilometers away from us. And we end up finding out that there's a shortcut that we can take. So there's this uh, sketchy little ferry crossing that crosses over the river that's gonna save us about an hour of time. So we're gonna hop on that. We're gonna get to the other side. We're gonna show you this track, so stay tuned. Jane's gonna break loose and we're not all <laughs> You're so paranoid. <laughs> 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 